Welcome back, everybody. This is part seven of episode one of The Wolf Among Us. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hopefully all of these have been cut together smoothly. If not, I'm very sorry. Um, yeah, so I don't know if this is the finale or not, so this might actually be part of the last episode, and you might get two intros in one video. Uh, let's check out what this note says. In donkey skin. Donkey? It's an envelope. That was my Shrek impression. My luck, it's a map of some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Open it. I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. This is an investigation. I, I have to find out these shit. So, uh... Well, I'm opening letters. It's a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. <laughs> it was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see Does he have a lily pad on his shirt? No lily pads? The weird little thing. <laughs> Does it always go that smoothly? Not often. So the prince is now? Lawrence is, yeah. Oh, right, I forgot about Lawrence. Our so maybe this won't be the finale. We'll see. When you put it that way. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. We can only be so nice. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. We are here on official Fabletown business. And we can be persuasive if necessary. Is or she my partner? I mean, like, officially? Or is she just, like, a, a friend involved in all this? Uh, okay, why can't I walk around? Why not just lead me there? Can you hear me? Just peep into someone's house. Check if he's home. I did. How is this any better than peeping? I'm pretty sure he's dead. Peeping on dead bodies. Wink, wink. Yeah, he looks dead. Oh, he's not. Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with him. No. No. Let me go. No. We need to know what happened. <laughs> it's Sushi. What is it that you're telling us? That's not weird. It's Sushi wa Water. Bigby. Water. Kitchen. Where else would it fucking be? Why does it gotta be kitchen water? Why can't it be like bathroom water? Are you too good for that when you're dying? I still drink from the bathroom think sink. Had a bit of a lisp there. Uh, check. Pay the rent next week. Pizza in the fridge. Please don't look for me. Goodbye. F. Did you find it yet? Okay. Interesting. This is really well put together. It's definitely different from uh, Walking Dead, but it's a great story. If good storytelling. Something to ask him. We should do it now. Who did this to you? 
Kind of looks like he did it to himself, though. Hey. What? Is that his answer, or is he dying and crazy? Still have that letter. Yes. It's only two words. But he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. Do you hear that in the background? Oh, it's the TV. Okay. <laughs> I thought I had. I thought I had a, a YouTube clip running or something. <laughs> Very confused until I saw the TV. Man, sound in this is great. Hopefully, I have it loud enough. I don't have to re record all this. Strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. Mm hmm. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, bullet hole. Bullet passed through the chair. Yeah, the angle works if he shot himself. So she left him. He got depressed, took some pills, drank some alcohol, and uh, shot himself. That's the story. The killer wants us to believe. Who knows if that's actually the truth? Okay. When do you think that was taken? Before all this. It's sharp. Is that the same knife you saw in the mirror? Yeah. Maybe he killed her. Why it's over here. I don't know. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? It's a good mystery. It really is. This does seem like the finale. Um, I thought there might be more to it. The toad fling. Um, so this will hopefully be the finale. So I can uh, be done recording. <laughs> It's tiring doing commentary. I'm not even great at it. Let's check this right. It might also be that I've been up since I was, um, since 2 a.m., so. What is it? It's currently 9. Jeez, I started recording at, like, 7. I also did have that snafu with the, uh, the... Um, hard drive and everything. Uh, all sorted out, by the way. Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. Oh. That doesn't really help. I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> What are they? Prescription sleeping pills. Okay, seems like we got everything here. He has something in his hand. I want to pick it up. <laughs> How can I pick this thing up in his hand? I don't know what it says. Did I miss my chance? Let's see. Let's Dusty. See. No one's read these in a while. 
Secondhand paperbacks. Old encyclopedias. Okay. So they've set up this place. Very well, mind you. There you look at that. Um, really seedy. A lot of personality. Open. Son of a... Let's look at it. What is that? What? Hey, no. Read it. Dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love, your devoted Lawrence. Hmm. Interesting. Hopefully they're together now. Not all we can hope for at this point. Can I read that note yet? <laughs> Oh, I think I found everything. Oh, Jesus. Stay here. <sighs> no. I I genuinely jumped at that. That must be the Tweedle D or Tweedle Dum. Um that was in the hey, toad's place. Stop. Leave me alone. Oh, I can't. <laughs> I can't end the episode like I wanted to. Uh, too much uh, quick time. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, B. Yeah. Ouch. Dick. Get him. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I pressed left trigger, not right trigger. I'm curious how these affect you by uh, failing them. Um. I'm sure it's just like a different cutscene or something, but um, it'd be interesting. Up, We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch! Make me run after you. Who are you? Why? <coughs> did oh, you definitely Tweedledee, Tweedledum. What? Why did you run? Fuck, man! Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed You've to do? Barged out of it. Man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him. Jesus. That'd be a nightmare fuel. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right <coughs> now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. It's a private eye? Who are you, exactly? I'm D, and I'm a private investigator. There's a business card in my shirt pocket. You can see for yourself. This is for a sandwich shop. Really? Huh. Must have run out. Who hired you? I can't tell you that. It's called Maloney. He hired him. Sorry. I'm sure you understand. Nope. Can't say it that. Has to be an important business card. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Oh, don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no. to. I'm D. He's dumb. 
Oh no. <coughs> you almost looked peaceful. What a dick. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Where'd they Where'd go? go? Well, after the one guy hit you and the other one finished kicking you. That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Cars that didn't run Get me up. over. Guess we're out of options. He mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. It seems like the end of the thing, but I don't, I don't want to end it if I have like five minutes left. We will. Okay, see you in the next episode.